this time we will begin the conferral of degrees by class. So we'll start with the NSNC students. They'll proceed. And P students, the nurse practitioner students, and the Master of Science in Nursing, uh, if they're in administration or on health or those those uh, programs. So I am very pleased to call to uh, the podium Sarah Junk, who will provide the remarks for the MSN degree. Sarah.
To further honor the privilege of having so many wonderful and supportive people in our lives, we will work further to decrease disparities and create opportunities in healthcare and education that would have otherwise been unavailable. In other words, we will help other people change their lives the way you will help us change ours. The power and reach of your support will become immeasurable. Rest assured, your generosity of spirit and contributions to our hard work have not been overlooked, nor are they anywhere near complete. The next few years represent a lot of firsts in our new roles. We will have many new fears, concerns, and responsibilities, and your continued support will be invaluable. The challenges of learning do not stop here. Job trainings, certifications, and doctorate level education awaits us. So let us all use this celebration and recognition of accomplishment as a chance to appreciate how truly blessed we are and to continue to dream for and work for things that seem beyond our wildest dreams. So, I wish heartfelt congratulations to everyone in this room, as everyone in this room has done something like changing. family that want to come down. Kristen Phoebus, pediatric nurse practitioner. Brenna Van Witt, pediatric nurse practitioner. Courtney Chaplin, pediatric nurse practitioner. Michelle Schnapp, Psych Mental Health Nurse Practitioner. <laughs> Roxanne Holm, Psych Mental Health Nurse Practitioner. <laughs> Joyce Pro, <laughs> Psych Mental Health Nurse Practitioner. Here I was here. <laughs> what? To the flash is getting too dark, but we're going to take a picture. It's dark. Jisha Johnson, family nurse practitioner. Michelle Betch, family. For D5. Yes, I get the last word. It's a tradition in academia that we signal the passage of our students from student status to graduate status by the movement of their tassel from the right side of their caps to the left. So graduates, to take your tassel and move it from the right side to the left. Represent the faculty in congratulating all of you once again uh, for all that you've accomplished. You have a great future ahead of you. We're very proud of your University of Iowa graduates, and I know that you will lead your colleagues and you will lead the profession in ways that you can't even imagine yet. So, congratulations. Before we adjourn, two things. Um, the DNP students want to have you leave first so that we can take your picture out in the courtyard. And I would ask for family and friends to wait till the graduates leave and then you can then you can move out. And thank you again for your uh, patience 